Hey everyone, this is Jared here with Team Adventures with BG, and today I'm taking a look at the Workhouse DL2. Uh, it's a dive light. Um, so, very cool product. Um, it is IPX8, which means it is water resistant down to 800 meters. Um, so, open it up. Uh, we've got the flashlight itself, uh, just a little guy, a um, little bit bigger than the hand. Uh, charging cable, USB A to USB C. Uh, we have two O rings, which are going to be very important for this light because it it is required for that extra water resistance. Um, it comes with a battery, so you could replace it, but that battery is rechargeable, so this is where you seat it, um, as well as a lanyard. So it does have an adjustable one, and it does have this non-grip um, silicone or plastic that'll help uh, keep control of it, because uh, you don't want to use it or lose it when you're 100 meters underwater. Um, that would be terrible. Uh, so getting into the light, um, you know, here's the look at it. Uh, that's where your lanyard will go. Um, it unscrews here. It's very tight. Um, and this is where the battery is. So a very large battery. Putting that back on, screwing it together. Uh, there's also the O-ring in there. That's two of them actually. So those are the little ones you'll replace to make sure that it stays uh, water resistant. Um, and here, a cool feature is a magnetic switch. Um, so it's got three modes. So there's one, two, and three. So one is the brightest. Um, so you're gonna get uh, 3,000 lumens with this. Um, moving on to two, you can see uh, that is 1,000 lumen. And then we end with one, which is just 300 lumens. So still bright, um, turn it back off. Uh, great light will run for 12 hours maximum. Another feature um, when it's on, you can see that that LED, so if it's green, that means it's 100 to give or take 75%. If it's flashing green, 75 to 50% of battery left life left. Um, red is 50 to 10, and flashing red is 10% or below. Uh, so it's not going to be super accurate, but it's going to let you know that you're in trouble if it starts uh, flashing red. You need to get out of the water. Um, so for me, I'm not a diver, but I do like to explore rivers. Um, and I have been in some mines that have been flooded and some caves as well. So if I need to go on an adventure where there's going to be water and I want to play around in it, um, this is going to be my go-to light. So if you're a diver or if you just like to adventure around water, great light. Um, so hang out and I'll take you outside and we'll get a look at these modes in the dark. Okay, everyone, I'm out here at my park. Uh, medium, uh, dark night. Um, but let's take a look at the Workhouse DLO2 and see how bright it is. Um, so this is the low mode, so it says it's 300 lumen. I think it may be a little bit more. Uh, moving on, there is 1,000 lumens. Um, so you can kind of see out to the trees, uh, to that berm, uh, maybe a little bit of the picnic table. And then moving over finally to the high, so that is 3,000. I feel like this is a very bright 3,000. Um, so you can clearly see the picnic table, trees. Um, I can see out to the fence. I'm not sure if you can see that far. But overall, this is a very bright uh, flashlight. Um, finally, you can, uh, let's see, see that flashing yellow green light? That is what the light will look like in the dark, so you know how much estimate uh, battery life you have left. So, uh, very bright flashlight at night. Um, so thanks for watching, and make sure you join me on my next adventure.